Hey, it's Jay for week nine for Gender Blenders, um, Thursday. Um, this week's topic is passing tips. Um, as far as, as far as passing goes, I think one of the most important things is confidence that you will pass. I mean, not like, you don't have to like walk in the room like you own the room, but like, um, just having confidence in yourself and not, um, second guessing yourself and anything like that. You just really don't like try and like concentrate on like trying to pass so much, just kinda let it go. Um, that's what I do. Uh, as far as stuff that like helps you pass, like physically, I just say binding helps a lot. Um, I wouldn't advise anybody try and bind themselves. I did and it actually like fucked up my back pretty bad. And it still kinda is fucked up because I haven't been to the chiropractor since. But um I advise you, you know, you just save up like the 35, 40 bucks and get a binder because it's, it's well worth it. Um, I actually got a size smaller than I was supposed to. I was supposed to be like a medium at Underworks. Um, I got small and it actually works like really well. I don't think a medium would be able to do as well as the small does. Um, it covers pretty good. Um, you can kind of tell, like I have to have a, the binder on then like a, like a regular under shirt like white t-shirt and then another shirt and that, that does it pretty well and I mean you can kind of tell but as long as I you know as long as it's not like form fitting to my body you can't really tell and when I have like a hoodie on or a sweatshirt or something like that you definitely can't tell so it works really really well um as far as other things go uh the haircut obviously like shorter hair I'm I don't think it's so much like having short hair, I think it's just having like more masculine haircut, not, you know, so like, I guess you could say fancy, like keep it pretty simple, um, what else, facial hair, I'm sure would help, uh, this is fake right here, obviously, so I'm not on testosterone or anything, I've never done this out in public, cause it's just, in the way it is, it would never work, um, just, you know, videos and pictures, I think maybe like trying like just sideburns but like not all of it it wouldn't work out trust me um but there is uh, another kind of method I use that doesn't work so well in pictures and videos because it's not as dark but you could probably get away with it a lot better using it um out in public so there's that which is just like it's gonna sound really I don't know if it's gonna sound strange but it's actually like taking my own hair and pretty much gluing it on my face with Vaseline it's also a warning, don't do this, because this is really retarded. I don't know why I thought of this. Well, I don't know why I did this and didn't think about it. If you're going to take animal hair, like I took cat hair, because I had darker hair, just kind of blend in, make it look better. Don't take an animal you're allergic to. I'm actually allergic to cats, and I couldn't, for like a week, I couldn't figure out why my face itched so damn much. And I never remembered, oh yeah, I'm fucking allergic to cats, duh. So don't do stupid shit like that, like I did. Um... But, yes. So, I think that's about it. I don't even know what else I would say. I kind of lost my train of thought. I'm kind of being fidgety and it's really hot in here. And my video camera might cut me off. So, I don't really know what else to say. I don't want to go on a long spiel about passing. But I'm pretty sure that's about it. All I have to say about it. I'm just rambling now. I should probably just shut the video camera off.